since we first caught a glimpse of it, Sound Shapes has puzzled us. What is it? Well, a platformer of sorts, but that doesn't cover it. It's one of those games that has to be shown rather than told. Q Tutorial. Yes, you control that little fried egg-like creature at the bottom there. Red is danger. Always avoid. The things you collect are notes. Once collected, they add to the game's backing soundtrack, building to a full tune. To move faster, you can change into a ball. Speed becomes your friend. It also helps you jump further. In fried egg form, you can stick to some objects, helping navigation through the stages. Keep all that in mind to get through the stage. Collecting notes, then enter the turntable at the end of the stage to complete. You're aiming to collect all the notes and complete the stage in the quickest time. Yes, global leaderboards for this. And then you have creation mode. Yes, you can construct your own levels and post them onto the network for others to play and rate. Little Big Planet is responsible for this trend, and we love it. Place down notes, shapes, monsters, and complex routes, and ta-da! We have a level. Time to put it to the test. There, complete. And our first real attempt at creating... Well, it was okay, but there were others out there who did a better job. On to the community levels. This one looked complicated, but we flew through it once we sussed the danger could be avoided altogether. Navigating this cog setup was tricky to say the least. Cranes didn't rack our cranium, but they were fun. And jumping into this UFO was a cool surprise. It's all a bit new, we give it a week or so, and some truly amazing creations will hit the community. Promise. There is, of course, a single-player campaign mode as well. Yes, developer created levels to inspire and test. Sound Shapes is, at its heart, a very addictive puzzle platformer after all. Campaign levels come in lots of different styles, depending on the track selected from different records. Yes, old-school styling, love it. We got really addicted to this level here and had to play it until we had top spot on the leaderboard. Some verdict then on sound shapes. Negatives normally come first. Well, it's style over graphical prowess here. Fans of polish and Hollywood-esque cutscenes, stay clear. Positives. Well, addictive gaming at its best. Once you pick up and play, it's really hard to put down. This can be played on both the PS3 and Vita, swapping between the two for owners of both. Very handy for on-the-move play. And adding the community creation tool was a brilliant move. Another never-ending game for the collection. Uber value for money. 9 out of 10 from us. Cool stuff.